everyone i hope you are all doing well today i'm honestly so excited to be sharing with you my top five gourmand sweet fragrances for women these are among the best fragrances in the gourmand category you know fragrances that have edible notes but they are not too overpowering they are really very good and they will get you so much compliments so yeah without further ado let's start i'm going to start with this fragrance by aquilina i've mentioned this fragrance loads of times on my channel it is the pink sugar sparks so it is not the original pink sugar believe it or not i'm not a fan of that original fragrance although it is so gourmand as they mentioned i find it to be a bit too much this is a very nice mixture between vanilla and sweet florals that are not overpowering this is a, a clone or you could say a dupe for uh, victor and rolf flower bomb this is an amazing fragrance it is so soft and feminine and sexy at the same time and i think because of its a soft gourmand aspect it could work all year round it has a mixture of all kinds of flowers underlined by very sweet and sultry vanilla so yeah this is the first choice the second fragrance i have with me is a classic and it is a very very old release this is burberry brit eau de toilette for women they have two versions eau de parfum and eau de toilette they are basically the same scent but the eau de parfum smells a lot stronger so i actually prefer this one this fragrance is a representation of almond vanilla heaven that's all you are going to smell so long lasting on the skin and projects so well and people are going to ask you what you are wearing every time you spray this fragrance I'm not going to show you the bottle unfortunately because because this bottle is still sealed but I'm going to insert a picture here and of course this list won't be complete without mentioning at least one flanker of Britney Spears fantasy this one is Rocker Femme. This Rocker Femme flanker, I think, has been released last year in 2015. It is an improved, more well grounded, and sophisticated, grown up version of Original Fantasy. It is creamier with the coconut and cream, underlined with all of this floral, vanilla, sweet goodness. It is actually so good. I think this would be an excellent choice for winter and autumn this is an amazing gourmand fragrance i would highly recommend that you do not ignore this flanker if you love the original britney spears fantasy you want something even better last longer on the skin this is your choice roca femme fantasy and of course i should mention my husband's favorite this fragrance is by vera wang it is princess night I have mentioned that I am not a fan of the bottle at all because it is glittery and so tacky looking. It is cheap looking to be honest, but the juice is actually very good. Man, isn't this so sensual and sexy? I remember the first time I sprayed it, I was in a department store before I got a full bottle. And when we went out, my husband asked me what's that you are wearing it smells so good it's so yummy it's so delicious it is so feminine and so good and you know for men usually they think that all women fragrances smell the same they usually say that they are so heavy sweet and synthetic and my husband is one of them he doesn't like many of the fragrances that i own but this one he thinks that it is amazing edible notes that are not too in your face and they are not going to repulse anybody again i think this would be suited for all year round nightwear special occasions this would be your choice if you own uh, gucci envy me number two you would know what i'm talking about because it smells really similar to that one that one is really rare to find and it is a great fragrance i used to own it long time ago so yeah the last fragrance i'm going to share with you today is actually polarizing but i think this is by far the best 
flanca of this fragrance that has been released so far it is Womanity, The Taste of Fragrance by Thierry Mugler. Of course, if you are familiar with Thierry Mugler fragrances, you know that they last so well on the skin and that you really have to be careful not to spray too much or else the scent, any scent actually, might be a bit offensive. So restrict yourself to a couple of sprays. Wear it in uh, the winter because it's an amazing fig woody fragrance it has fig chutney in the heart my god if you smell this you would know that it doesn't smell like anything else if you are a fan of fig fragrances with some vanilla and some woods you will love this one i would highly recommend that you look for this one taste of fragrance so it is not the original humanity eau de parfum or eau de toilette or pour elle or the other flankers or the essence it is the taste of fragrance because they emphasize all of these gourmand notes in this fragrance with the fig chutney so yeah this is my list for today i hope you enjoyed spending time with me and that you found this video and these recommendations helpful for you please stay tuned for my other upcoming videos and leave me suggestions in the comments on what you would like to see next I'll speak to you very soon. Until then, as usual, please be safe. Bye.